What's up guys? So you just learned how to install WordPress at SiteGround and now you want to activate their CDN feature. What is a CDN and how do we activate it? Well, that's what this video is going to cover for you today. A CDN is a website feature that increases the speed at which your pages load, aka your page load speed. So when you click on a link, the page will load faster. And the beauty of a CDN is it uses servers all around the globe to make sure that wherever someone's visiting your website or blog from, it should load fast because they have a server near that location. Some hosts don't have free CDNs, but SiteGround's got it, so we want it. They offer it for free through their partnership with Cloudflare, and basically you're gonna get access to over 100 different servers at Cloudflare that will help you increase your page load speed. So there's a lot more to it than that, but before we lose anyone, let's just get this whole thing set up. So we're gonna to go to websites, And we can see we have our one website here and they mention a lot of cool features including the Cloudflare CDN. So you can just click add to get that site fasterness and add the free option. Let's click add. All right, so it's gonna tell us what's available in the free option. And there's also a premium option which has some other benefits like more page specific settings and um, yeah. These other check marks here, web application firewall, polish and mirage. So that is a great addition if you're extremely into page speed, but for now we're just generally trying to increase the page speed of our site. And maybe you can do the premium option later. So to get this going, let's go back to our websites. And now we're just gonna click on the site tools button. All right guys, now we're gonna click on speed and Cloudflare. Awesome. And here's our Cloudflare CDN. We can see that there's a little description about the service and Cloudflare configuration. Have in mind that depending on your site and setup, configuring Cloudflare, well I'll say that 10 times fast, may require professional expertise. If you're not sure how to set it up, you may need to contact your developer first. Well, good thing we contacted SiteGround support and Zeliasco explained to us all the details of the service, so we're good to go. Another awesome five-star experience at SiteGround. And now we just need to go through the setup options here. But before we do so, guys, I want you to open up your site, which in our case is just how to install WP at SiteGround.com. And we are gonna make sure to add the www into our domain name, because that's the way it works. And if you don't remember your login, that's fine. You can always go to WordPress, install and manage, and then you just click on the little arrow into a doorway for your domain name. Okay, awesome, so here we are. To get the www on our site, which we don't have yet, it's just the shortened.com, we're gonna wanna go to our dashboard, and we're gonna click on settings, general and now we're going to add the www in the wordpress address url and the site address url and we're going to make sure those two boxes are identical and now come down and just save it and don't worry if someone ever visits your domain name and they don't enter in the www it will redirect to the right place okay so it logged us out real quick we're just going to log back in and if you don't see your www yet, just keep refreshing and it'll work. And if you still don't see it, then try to delete the cache. We have our free extension here. And there we have it, guys. So now our www is showing up. We have our full domain name active, and we're going to go through with the process in Site Tools. Let's go back to Cloudflare. And we're going to go through the three-step process by clicking Setup down here. We just need to set up a new Cloudflare account. All right, we're gonna put the email in that we used for the WordPress login and a password. And click confirm and create. All right, it was success. And now we just need to go up to the select domain option and choose your domain. And important, your site will be reconfigured to work through www and traffic to URLs without www 
will be redirected to URLs with www. That's a lot to say. So feel free to read through it if you want more. Basically what's going on here guys is that when you activate Cloudflare in the SiteGround site tools, your domain name is being pointed through www CNAME to the Cloudflare servers and that gives you access to all of their speed and increased resources that they host on their end. You are basically gaining access to their server so now you have the SiteGround server and you're using parts of the Cloudflare server so you have the best of both worlds. So we're just going to activate the free option as we mentioned earlier. All right guys, congratulations. Cloudflare for your domain name has been activated. There's a few more settings down here that you can manage if you'd like. You can purge the cache. You can change the caching level. And you can go into develop mode if you'd like. So there's a lot more robust stuff here if you really want to tinker with your site and gain even more milliseconds and seconds of page speed. This is all great stuff to know, but for now you've gained definitely an edge and advantage on your competition who is not using the SiteGround free CDN. I want to say thanks so much for watching. Thank you so much to the support at SiteGround. Zell Yazko helped us so much with this video. It's super easy to get support at SiteGround, guys. You just start by clicking on the question mark and then hitting the contact us button and you're going to be loving their services and their personalized support so please make sure to subscribe for more free wordpress answers hit the like button if you learned something here and i will see you in the comments and of course in the next video covering wordpress awesomeness talk to you soon i'm greg narayan thanks for watching